for this braided ponytail. It is super quick and super easy and really perfect for summer when you just want to get your hair up and off of your neck. And the way that I did it, it actually looks pretty cute just with like a side part and the rest of your hair down and just like the side braided. So you could also do that or you could pull it up with a ponytail like me or you could even braid the ponytail to have another huge braid. The possibilities are endless. So I hope that you like it and let's get started. First you are going to part your hair on the side and I also like to just completely separate this side section so that when I'm doing the braid I know exactly where to pull the hair in from. And then you're going to start doing the side braid. So I just take this small piece in the front top of that side section, separate it into three equal sections and then take the right piece, cross it under the middle, then the left piece, cross it under the middle and then when you do the right piece under the middle again you're going to add some hair from the top part and then when you cross the left under you're going to add some hair from the bottom part and I like to just leave a little bit of hair out from around my ear to give it that messy undone look. You're going to continue doing this adding hair from the left and right until you get kind of where your ponytail is going to be and I have to be kind of more strategic on how I pull hair back into it because I want to hide my extensions but because we pull apart the braid it's pretty easy to hide any clips or extensions that you may have in your hair and then once you stop adding hair in just continue the braid all the way down your hair and then once you get down as far as you want to go just loosely hold the end of your braid and start pulling apart your braid to make it look a lot thicker to do this I just like to take my pointer and thumb and pinch on the outside part of each section of the braid and pull outwards and upwards to make it fan out and look a lot thicker and then secure the bottom with a small clear elastic and pull it apart even more. I like to do the first round of pulling it apart with just my hand at the bottom so that it's looser and I can get the hair pulled out a lot and then when you put the elastic on it gives it some security and grip so that each piece you pull out stays where you want it to. This actually turned out to be a super cute hairstyle in itself with just the side part and hair down but I'm going to do the ponytail so I get my middle part back again and then I kind of sweep the hair backwards and I'm going to do my ponytail kind of like in the middle of the back of my head and I take a bungee cord elastic. I like these because I can do it as tight as I want it and I just wrap that around my hair and stick the hooks in to secure it. And then I pull at the crown of my head to give that part more volume and I tease the ponytail to give that a ton more volume. And then I'm just going to take a small piece of hair and wrap it around my elastic to give the hairstyle a little bit more of a finished look and bobby pin that in place. Usually I just leave the hairstyle as it is, but I decided I wanted to spice it up a little bit and show you guys a few other ways that you could style this look. So I've been obsessed with hair clips lately, so I thought why not add a few and I kind of went overboard, but I think it looks so cute. So I'm just kind of placing them at different angles throughout the braid and just layering big ones with little ones in different colors and I think it looks so so cute it's just a really fun way to spice up any hairstyle this hairstyle would also look so cute with a scarf or scrunchie so I'm just showing you how it would look with a scarf slash scrunchie I'll link it below for you guys it just makes the look a little bit more fun and whimsical and perfect for summer hope you like this hairstyle let me know in the comments if you did and I will see you next time with another one.